So I've already done two guides on, I've done one, uh, the team of the season Suso uh, from AC Milan and team of the season David Neres from Ajax. Now we've got this guy who I've never actually heard of because I don't tend to literally check up on the Serie A. Uh, but we've got this guy who's from Roma and he's a camp. Uh, so for the objective, let's actually go back a second and have a look. You've got to assist 15 goals using Italian players in squad battles. So again, we see this one pretty much every week, but for a different nationality. It probably only takes about maybe an hour, uh, depending on how good you are at the game. The main thing about this one is having a decent midfield. So I put together a team and I've put some midfielders on the bench. Go for the team first. You can build a full, a full Italian team. Or you could go for like a Serie a, uh, Serie a team with a fair few Italians in there. But don't even in goal because I used this guy in form and he was honestly probably one of the best keepers I used uh, at that time of FIFA. It's quite a few months ago now but was a solid goalkeeper. This guy put in here for uh, literally because he's got 85 pace so he run up on that left hand side. Uh, again, for Lenzi, uh I don't think there's a better right back in the Serie 8 other than Cancelo. Uh, I mean, actually, there's that foot birthday Savage. You've got Cancelo, but obviously he's not Italian. You've got Savage, who, again, isn't Italian. Actually, there's quite a few right-backs. Tell that, there's quite a few. But he's definitely by far the best Italian one. Left mid, El Shirari, again. I think looking at him, there's literally no other alternatives. Right mid, we've got this guy. Again, just a mediocre right mid. Okay pace, decent height. Fires our skill moves, which is good. I think, what's El Shirari? Yeah, he's also 5-star, so he do uh, like to do a lot of skill moves. Both of them has got 5-star uh, skill moves. Centre mid, Jorginho. Again, probably one of the best centre mids from Italy, from Italy on the game. And for next to him is Bonaventura. I'm going to finish up top with two strikers from Torino. 5-star, Wheatfoot and Bellotti. I was having a look at Italian Serie A strikers. And I'm not going to lie, there's not a lot of them at all. There's like Balotelli, Balotti, uh, Zaza, and then there's like this other one who I can't pronounce his name, but it has a bunch of informs. Uh, I'm going to put Zaza in there just because there's literally no other good alternatives who's above uh, the height of six foot. So that's the team I put together. Also put some midfielders on the bench. So we've got this guy, we've got Vasquez, we've got Pellegrini, we've got him, I'm not going to try and say his name. It's the same for this guy and that guy as well. So there's a bunch of midfielders on the bench, you want to make it a bit cheaper, so Jorginho could swap up for that guy, uh, you could swap them out, literally do what you want, there's a bunch of players you can use for objective, main tips for this one, I recommend going for a three at the back formation, because you don't have to win the game, so lots of midfielders, less defenders, maybe ultra attacking, uh, and yeah, essentially you don't have to get the win, so you can literally just play all out attack the whole game and just attack, attack, attack and just not even defend that much.